رمضان أقبل يا أولي الأحلام فاستقبلوه بغاية الإكرام السلام عليكم Brothers and sisters, Allah tells us in three different sources of the Quran one thing that every soul shall go through. He says, Kullu nafsin maut. But Every soul shall taste it. I will taste it. You will taste it. Those before us have tasted it. Those coming after us are going to taste as long as they come to this life. So death is an inevitable reality that causes the question to linger on our mind. And the question is, where will my time be up? Brothers and sisters, because we do not have control of our death, nor the answer to this question, we should not be overly worried about it. Rather, every time we ask ourselves this question, it should bring about two more important things in our mind. Number one, purpose of death. Allah tells us in Quran 67 verse 2 that Allah says it is the one who has created life and death in order to test which of you is best indeed. So, instead of worrying about when death will come, we should rather be worried about how many good deeds we have done. This leads us to the second most important thing, which is preparation for death. Inshallah, we are going to give you important ways of preparing for death in this episode. Number one, Surakot Jariya. This is a long-term charity that accrues continuous reward from Allah, even after one's death. It includes acts of charity such as building of a well, school, mosque, or hospital. And even if you don't have the capacity to do all these acts, you can also engage in part of charity such as smiling, giving useful and good advice to people, and also helping people in distress. Secondly, seek it out of righteousness. An Islamic scholar said, Seek Secret bad deeds brings about destruction, while secret out of righteousness brings salvation. And lastly, usefulness to humanity. The late American Muslim minister, Malik El Shabazz, often known as Malcolm Hay, said, Great people live their lives with the assurance that they will be more useful in death than in living. Brothers and sisters, we hope you always be mindful of all these important things every time you remember death. May Allah grant every one of us a good ending. Wassalamu alaikum.